What do you think? I'm not sure. I don't see a sign. <laughs> going on you guys it's your boy gi joe sunday i'm out here in la we're at uh angels city brewery yo it looks like a rundown building when we pulled up but there's mad people here so this is low key Check out their water hydration system. Got the cups. Pretty dope. Hi. Hi. Sorry. Hi, Hi. Sorry. Joe. Nice to meet you. Hi. Bye, Ilani. Nice to meet you. Is this the birthday girl, Myra? Hey. Oh, him? Oh. <laughs> oh, him. Yeah. Oh, I'm uh, 27. And then this is. I am Sergio. This is my Hi. first time. This is your first time. My first time as well. Cheers, bro. Cheers. Oh, what's up, bro? How you doing? Good to see you. I don't think so. Hi. Other friends just got here. Oh, this is for my vlog. Hi, how are you? Good. How are you? Good. Say what's up to my Hello. shadow. How are you guys? This is Steph, Alex is big, and then this is her man Benson, right? Hey. How you doing, bro? Very good. Are you guys going to have some beer? Yeah, did you guys get one? I'm, I had my first one. I might get another one. Did you try the, the little, little Tokyo? You guys drink a lot? Austin? Maryland. The Maryland's here. So is your tolerance up? It's higher. It's probably higher than <laughs> Mine is freaking low, man. <laughs> After that first beer, bro, I was already feeling like a little bug, right. honestly. Oh, hey, how are you doing? Introduce yourself. Hi, Stephanie. Hi, how you doing? Good. How are you? This is a twin. Oh, I'm Melissa. So I got the little Tokyo. I don't normally drink, but um, I've been having a solid clean bulk season, and I have about two weeks before, no. First week of March, I will be in prep. And then that's when it's game time. I'm about to walk around and show you guys this spot. It's pretty dope. I've never been here before, but these dudes are playing that game cornhole or whatever. Versus Carmen and Moy. I just went up. I got four points. What we're playing for is a double date at the movie theaters. Whoever loses has to pay for their the loser the winner's tickets and whatever else. So it's go time. We're up 4-0. I just went. Their turn. Let's get it. Week. Uh, does that count? All right, that doesn't count in my book. Let's go, Alex. What's going on? So we lost all of the games. I mean, all of them. We didn't win not one game. We played four, I think. We didn't even come close to winning not one game. Thank you. It's embarrassing. I suck at it. I didn't realize that I suck at it until the third game. But um, on our way home now, about to get some food. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Peace. Shoulder presses? Some type of press or what? This one? What's going on, you guys? It's your boy G.I. Joe. Tuesday at the gym with my boy Ramona Day. We're gonna hit shoulders and also throw a little biceps in her day. Let's get it. I've never done this movement before, but I'm trying to switch it up. I'm trying to get this, I'm trying to get different gains, baby. I'm trying to get in every way possible. Let's get it.
right now we're doing Arno presses before this I probably only done this like once or twice and it's kicking my ass right now but it's always good to switch it up and the reason why I didn't like to do this before is because it's weird it feels weird on my joints What up, this is my boy Ramon. Say what up, bro. What's up, it's Ramon. What's your Instagram, bro? Instagram is Raymond, R-A-Y-M-O-A-N-N. -N. My boy just came out with his brand. It's, it's nothing, it's not out yet. It's just a little preview, a little sample. Keep it, keep it. What's it about, bro? Let me see the back. Back for more fitness, baby. That's pretty dope. Yep. So how'd you come up it. with that, man? Man, because I'm a machine. All the homies are machines, like yourself. Thank so, you, bro. Check it out, it's a machine. We coming back for more. Yo, shout out to my sponsor, BPI. Got the Apple Pair right here. Best pre-workout in the game, baby. I'm feeling it. If you guys don't like pre-workouts that make you feel like a lot of anxiety or you feel like your heart's racing, you don't like that and you just want to feel energy, this is a good workout, a pre-workout right here. Check it out. You can see it at bodybuilding.com or also uh, bpisports.com as well. Let's get it. We hit the shoulder at all angles, the side, the front, the rear. Right now we're focusing on the rear right now. If you guys want to build your rear delt, because that's something that apparently a lot of people lack in, this is a good way to hit it. Don't even go for heavy weight, just focus on the form and focus on that rear delt. Right now we're gonna hit three sets, 10 and 10 on each, the medium weight. Now, moving on to another tricep movement, check it out. We're hitting three or four sets. When you're trying movements like this, what's important is the range of movement. Basically, we're just keeping in an area where we're feeling nothing but contraction, nothing but a burning sensation in those triceps. Uh, we're doing, I'm doing about 12 to 15, and also doing, uh, we're supersetting with diamond push-ups. Yo, so you often hear people or a lot of people want to know how you build definition or how you build muscle. You have to apply pressure. Every time you come to the gym, don't let your muscles rest pretty much. Like if you're sweating and you have a pump, keep the pump put up. Gotta get my set in. That's right. Yeah, so like I was saying, it's all about applying pressure and hitting the muscle at every angle. And focusing on contraction, like at the end of the day, that's what it's really about. If you get contraction, get uh, blood flow into the veins, you will see results. But it has to be consistent. It's not going to happen over over a week, but you really have to put in work. Like, let's get it.
So I'm about to finish off biceps with this crazy, crazy burnout. This is what I'm talking about, about exhausting your muscles and just pushing it to another level. Let's get it. What's going on? Just got home. Man, that was a great workout. It's time to eat. Gotta get that white rice. Probably just about a cup. Yeah, that's probably a cup. Wow. That's probably about like six, seven ounces of ground turkey. Also about to have some salad. You've got to get your greens in there. Just straight up salad. Straight up. Helps your digestive system if you know what I'm talking about. What's going on? Man, I am stuffed. That was so bomb. I had a great meal. Had a great workout. And now I just kind of want to talk a little bit because uh, I'm about to go into prep and I started this channel to sh really show you guys what I go through during prep and not only that but what I got going on on the side and where I'm trying to take all of this. Once I start prep it's going to be uh, 30 minutes steady slow paced a day and then we're going to go from there. Um, as far as my diet, I am going to carb cycle. Um, it's, it works with me. It, I feel like that, that diet for my type of body really works. It helps me bring my best physique possible. Um, some people do a keto diet. Um, I'm good on a carb cycle. I love competing. Like, it's crazy. That feeling, that experience of stepping on stage is crazy. And not only that, I mean, the hard work that, that's put into it and the sacrifices, it's all worth it. It really is all worth the time that I need to spend in the gym, the cardio I need, the amount of cardio I need to do, it's not a big issue to me. Why? Because I'm willing to do whatever it takes. One thing about prep is uh, I, I isolate myself. Um, I don't really do too much. Um, I, if I do go out, it has to be for an occasion. I don't uh, drink during prep. I keep it, I keep it like solid during prep because it all matters it all matters and and some people you know do things differently but the pros and the champs the ones i follow the ones i look up to they're not messing around during prep and why should i mess around if i'm trying to be where they're trying to be so yeah i'm very serious when it comes to prep i really isolate myself and some people don't understand that and it, and honestly my explanation is because i'm like I'm trying, I'm chasing something. You know, it's all about sacrifices, and I—that's something that I had to uh, have a talk with myself about, and just accept that. Accept that. You know, you you're gonna have to do things a lot differently. You're gonna have to live your life a lot differently, and I'm okay with that. Yeah, I can't wait to start prep. I probably—it's either gonna be the first or second week of March. I will start prep. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit that like button. Peace.